love that. But having left the band behind, Max is back with his first ever solo single. Um, I mean, it's called Barcelona. It is. Tell us a little bit about it. It's, it's a bit of a link to, the, to your real life a touch, isn't it? A little bit, yeah. Um, when we were coming up with the concepts of the video, uh, I wanted a girl in it that could like had something about her that was like she could do something really cool and surfing I saw a video of her and I was like Laura's perfect so we called her and the management were happy to do it and I mean she's like she's a star of the video I, I didn't have to do anything um she literally just took over and and did it for me so it was um she was great and there was no mention of Love Island at that stage obviously then. No. no she didn't know that she was going to end up on the telly doing that no not at all um I remember it was only about two weeks ago or something I got a text saying Laura's going on Love Island and I was like oh okay well that's not a bad thing I guess so uh, so I started tuning in after that yeah and uh, I now get why everyone loves it well she came across as such a nice girl and they're quite vulnerable actually in, in yeah. Love Island so mm. you clearly spotted talent Max this is another well, talent know, of your own. I know I'm glad you said that. <laughs> <laughs> but she's a nice girl so as you she say was, yeah, it's, yeah she deserves it all but um, yes just going back to the solo aspect of it um, I mean it's taken a bit of time I suppose to get to where you want to be right now has it? why was that why did you take your time to sort of put the new music out yourself? Uh, well I, I was signed to sort of Warner in in the US about three years ago, I was working alongside Jason Derulo there. Did a load of songs and then um, a load of staff left and it was going to take too much time um, to, to get the song out. So um, about six months ago, I decided to put my own label together and that's why it, it was just a label thing is why it took so long. Yeah, but it feels right, I guess, now. It, it just does, feels yeah. like a good, a good time. Yeah, yeah. I think three years ago, if I'd just done it, I probably wasn't ready anyway. So I think the fact that I've had that time to kind of adapt to uh, doing it on my own, uh, I think, works well for me. And you talk about Jason Derulo there, but you, you credit him with sort of giving you a huge confidence boost. Yeah, yeah. Well, he was the one that was... He was the guy that told me that uh, I could do it on my own and he had all this confidence in me and he had a direction for me. So that kind of was the first time that I thought, yeah, maybe I'll, I'll have a go on my own. Yeah, and here yeah. you are. What does it feel like, though, going solo? Because you are slightly protected when there's other guys with you. Yeah, Whether yeah. it's even doing interviews yeah. or, or anything, in fact, know, yeah, on stage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, how does it feel? Have you sort of become a bit accustomed to it? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good with it. Um, I've kept everything close, like my tour manager is like my best mate from growing yeah. up and the record labels with my dad. So it's it kind of feels like I'm not on my own anyway. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm getting used to it. Yeah. I'm getting used to it. Long way to go yet, though. Well, Tom got married just a few weeks ago, wasn't it? He did, yeah. And so you sort of got together then, of course. What was that like? It was, um, from what I remember, it was amazing. <laughs> Um, yeah, Kelsey looked beautiful, and yeah, it was a great, a great weekend. Yeah, it was, um, it was a free nighter as well, so it was, um, yeah, it was a, it was a long Monday afterwards. Well, I can imagine. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So is there ever any talk of you guys getting together, or are you all just happy with where you're at? at well, the it, it's sort of been mentioned, uh, but it's more sort of like, oh, I'd love to do something again, because uh, I loved being in the one. You know, I had so much fun, and I loved the guys, and. Um, yeah, I mean, one day maybe we can do something. I'm not sure what that'll be, whether it's a tour or new music, I'm not sure, but... Yeah, it's not a no-no. I'd be up for it. Well, it's fun just listening to the songs there again. It all just comes flooding back straight yeah. away. It, it did work, didn't it? Yeah, just yeah. great music at the time. Yeah. Um, so, of course, now, you, you're in America for most of the year, really, aren't yeah. you? Yeah, I live over and there. And strangely enough, you moved to Vegas for a quieter life. That's not how I would describe Vegas at it, all, Max. Well, yeah, it didn't start off that way. Uh, once I'd survived the first month, of living there, um, I kind of that's when it relaxed a little bit because <laughs> the strips there if you need it. Whereas at first it was you sort of wanted it all the time. But um, yeah, I'm I'm pretty relaxed there now. I've got my two dogs and my girlfriend there, so it's nice. Yes, your lovely girlfriend. So, but you do come back home quite a bit. Can you see yourself coming back to the UK full time eventually? I th yeah, I think so. Uh, I think Manchester will always be home. Yeah. So. Um, I think, yeah, I can see myself coming back. But the big question is whether Carrie wants to come with you. Probably not. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll have to ask her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she, she's just moved to Budapest for three months, so um, I, she might love it there. I might have to move there at some point. Yeah, well, that's what you do. That's what you do for the price of love. So what's coming up in terms of, like, the single is out now, obviously, yeah. in Barcelona. What's next in terms of new music and where we're going to see you next? Uh, well, I, I'll start doing gigs soon. Um, but it's, like, it's step by step, Barcelona and then... We're talking about the next single, maybe October, November time. Right. Um, but 
because it's on my own label, it's like you, you kind of have to wait and see how the first one does. No, you know? of course, of course. So, but it's nice to be in charge of it, isn't it? You know what I mean? It, you're the one yeah. that's coming, you're the one picking Laura, you know, it's, that's great. You've got full control. Yeah, it is nice. Um, it's a bit more responsibility. Yeah. So um, I have to kind of behave myself a little bit more and <laughs> sort of be on it. Um, but yeah, it's, it's nice, it's a bit more freedom and... Um, yeah, so, and hopefully uh, an album maybe next year, but uh, like I say, just one step at a time. Yeah, exactly. You're enjoying it. That's the main thing. I am. Minute, yeah, aren't you? I and love the, it. The song is brilliant. It's very summery. It looks gorgeous. She looks brilliant in it as well. Yeah, she does. It, it does. It just works. So, so good to see you, Max. It's you been too. ages since Thanks I saw you last. Me. Yeah, good luck with it all. Thank, Thank you. you.